got some old doors, like 3 16 I'm gonna build a eight inch bucket for my backhoe. A piece of cardboard here. Make my side templates. Keep you posted. Put that on there. I got four of these, so I could probably grind this angle iron off. Let's trace this out, cut her out with the plasma cutter. Get your two sides, keep you posted. Now we got our sides cut out. Now we'll uh, put them together like a sandwich and then grind them all nice. Back at you. I got them in the vise, they're not exactly the same. Got her clamped in, get flush on the bottom, flush on the side, and then we'll start grinding that all so they're both the same. Alright, I actually cut a mouth in there. Got a mark T here for top here for top so it'll just be on the outside and I'll start running my steel around here for the bottom of the bucket at this kind of Pell steel was closed today I needed some plate steel closed on Saturdays until further notice so I'll have to look for some more scrap I got enough here for the for the, for the bucket part. That'll be the next step. Keep you posted. And we're gonna start building the bucket, the back part. So I'm gonna measure round all the way through here. See how much product you need. Keep you posted. So we need 38 inches from here to do the whole thing. And this panel I got is only 30 by 25. So I'll cut two uh, 25s, bevel them, butt weld them. And then go from there. Keep it posted. We got our two pieces. Then we'll uh, got this beveled. Fill that in with well and I'll have one piece. Keep it posted. Okay, we got one long piece. And we'll start cleaning her up and start bending her on the sides. Let the games begin. We got that tacked here, tacked here, tacked here. Got her level. I'm gonna have to put something across here as I'm bending to keep that thing at eight inches. Or whatever the width is in between here. Close to eight. All right, keep it posted. Making it a little bit narrower in the back so the dirt slides out easier. Is this like eight inches? Seven and three quarter between here. And I cut this a little bit smaller. This is a uh, seven and a half. So it'd be a half inch smaller in the back than in the front, or a quarter inch. I got seven, a quarter inch smaller. Should have made this uh, maybe eight and a half. Yeah, just a bucket. I'm gonna start stitching here. When I start getting ready to bend, I'll fill you in. I'll show you. I got that welded on the inside. Now we're going to start 
bending this around. Start bending it around. Keep tacking as you go. Keep you posting. Well, I got a half ass bent around there. Just all tacks, I gotta grind all this stuff down. I weld it from the inside. Now get the top on there. Gotta weld the plate in here, support this. Support up in here. If I use a piece of pipe, run that across, and then I'll put my brackets up here for the where it mounts. This little eight inch bucket. And when I get the other parts on and I get on the machine and paint it up, I'll give you a shout. Okie doke.